When you get to the general election, I thought Americans had a choice between two very good men. I've known John McCain for 30 years, and there's nobody in American politics that I respect more or like more. He is a genuine hero, but I think it simply wasn't his time. It is always difficult, I think, for any incumbent party that has been in office for eight years to win basically what would be a third term. Uh, it was even more complicated because 80% of the American people this time around thought the country was headed in the wrong direction. You had a president with very low approval ratings and you had uh, two uh, wars in progress. Then when the fiscal crisis hit in September, I think it became, in my opinion anyway, all but impossible for a Republican to win. On top of that, Barack Obama was a very formidable opponent, and McCain, I think, just simply did not run a very good campaign. And now, why do I say that? I say it for this reason. In primaries, Democrats usually run to the left because that's where their base, the people who raise the money for them, the true believers are. Republicans do just the opposite. They always run to the right because that's where their base is, that's where their big, big givers are, that's where their true believers are. Then, once the primaries are done, candidates from both parties generally run back to the center in an effort to get the independent voters who usually uh, decide presidential races. What happened this time around is McCain did just the reverse. During the primary, he ran to the left because he basically is to the left with most of the Republicans who were running this year. 